live game at Oakwell on Sunday, Barnsley's Clint Marcel. Of all the teams alerted to the talents of Clint Marcel this summer, only Barnsley's Danny Wilson was brave enough to take a gamble. And so far, it's paying off, because the Trinidadian international has not only brought his scoring boots with him, but a little bit of Caribbean fanboyance too. And it was West Brom who were first to suffer on the opening day. Marcel's close control and dancing feet are going to pose a constant threat to defenders in Division 1 this season. But what really has him standing out is his blistering pace. There won't be many who can catch him, and if they do, they've got to stop him before he unleashes that lethal right foot. goal against Huddersfield last Sunday proves how devastating he can be. A simple layoff to Thompson, a burst of pace that finds him acres of space for the return, and the confidence to set it up on his left foot to the game in the bridge. The reverse angle shows how tight things were and that his left foot can be just as productive as the right. Barnsley manager Danny Wilson probably won't thank me for highlighting his new star so early in the season, but when you find a midfield playmaker with explosive speed, great close control and a goal-scoring touch, it's just too good to ignore. Confidence high at Barnsley early season, as we said already. How much do you know about this young man? Um, I've watched him twice now, and I think he's a great prospect. I think um, Danny Wilson, manager of Barnsley, uh, put some faith into him. I think he's repaying him. He looks a very good prospect. It appears not much was known about him among the football league defenders. Yeah, that's why I think um, he's causing a bit of a shock. No one knows much about him, but he's uh, he's hit us with a storm. I mean, he's scored two great goals now, and I think um, a lot of teams will be watching him closely, and a lot of managers will be saying to get close to him. But I think he's that kind of player where if you do get close to him, he's a bit in kind of like Georgie Kinklazi's class where get close to him, he might make you look a bit before he go around you, and he's done that on a couple of times in the game on Sunday, and I think yeah, he looks a quite a good player. We've talked about one of the success stories of the week, now the latest batch of shooting